celebrating all of these people who were massively upset at Trump's election. You've seen the videos, people screaming. Should we be celebrating this? No. Caveat. Unless they're from Hollywood. Then they deserve it. Then they deserve it. Yeah, it's not only their fault, but they really hurt you. The nurse who's having a bad day and is performatively extra angry that their candidate didn't win compassion for them. I agree. I would believe that they are actually upset. I don't think they're that upset. I would hope not. They shouldn't be. But have some compassion. They probably didn't do anything to you. Hopefully they're still going about their day to day. you anything to have a little bit of compassion, a little bit of kindness towards them, give them the benefit of the doubt, give them a little bit of leeway, and then if they betray it, awesome, go nuts, have fun, have fun with their suffering, but initially, give them some charity. same person is from Hollywood, revel in their suffering. You are totally justified with your sense of schadenfreude. It is totally fine, because those people ruined your favorite things. They have been on a crusade to march through things you enjoy and destroy them, degrade them, debase them, devalue them, deconstruct them. in the suffering of people who made you suffer. It's not perhaps the most principled, virtuous, ideal way to behave or emote, but very human, understandable.
cause them to reevaluate. Probably not. They'll probably double down, dig deeper. But maybe some of them go, you know what? Actually, I didn't really buy into this in the first place, which I think a lot of people didn't. And they can go, you know what? It's not getting me anything. I should just come out and say, yeah, you know what? I didn't like this person. This person was a bad candidate. They backed up a dump truck full of cash for me to say that I supported her. I don't, and I didn't. I took the money. I'm not giving the money back. But you know what? Eh, she was terrible. I didn't like her. Kind of like the other guy. Maybe stop with the whole uh, putting politics and entertainment and art. I think we probably could and should. And uh, you know what? The next thing that I make, I'm not going to put it in there. Fingers crossed. We can hope. can hope they see the light. Of course, if they don't, realistically, the nature of the market that we live in means that other people are going to come in and take over. And they'll make new stuff, and maybe it'll be good. Eventually, it'll be good. It might be okay at first. Eventually, it could be good. At the very least, it'll be more fun than the stuff that came before because that's such a small, low bar to me. something other than, you know, an artful form of entertainment. It's cringe. And I've got to imagine that So you know what? Maybe stop doing it. Might be a good idea. For your art. For your soul. And for all the rest of us. Until then, of course. 
Wars. We will be. Very happy. To rejoice. you are a major Hollywood elite. This is not aimed towards you. I understand you might be upset. Hopefully you're not that upset. Because I don't know if it's merited. But for you, I have compassion for you. I really do. For the fact that you know you're suffering now, absolutely. However, if you've been on a billboard for a Hollywood movie, please feel free to comment below. But you deserve this. Yeah, you deserve it. Not the end of the world. This is justice. Good luck in all your endeavors. Thank you for your time and attention. And I shall say farewell.